all of which are an assortment of lovable characters brought together in this 40-minute play featuring characters from the Irish TV series Dinan. The Lambert Puppet Show, which has been traveling the world since 2005, has entertained more than 30,000 children and adults around the globe. Guaranteed to bring out the guffles of even the parents, this highly visual show with its simple storylines is produced to cater all ages. What does the dog do? Chase the animals away. We enjoyed the show very much. I think inside all of us there's a, a child that enjoys all theatrical events and it's lovely to see these in Sharjah. Uh, we have a perfect venue here. We often, you know, uh, laugh backstage as we're performing when we hear the deep voices of the daddies laughing at, yeah. at the jokes that the children don't get, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's fantastic. With 16 puppets speaking in an assortment of accents, Noel Lambert and wife Eva are the only puppeteers behind the scenes. The puppets and their colorful costumes are also fashioned and created by the couple who have been involved in puppet theaters all their lives. I started as a child. My mother and father, May and Eugene Lambert, were both puppeteers and I started working in the family business very, very young at the age of six. Now in the Emirate of Sharjah, Qanat al Qasba bring their audiences two days of unparalleled yes. laughter and fun. Well. Our vision here in Qanat al Qasba is to be uh, the most visited destination here in Sharjah. The reason we chose the No Lambert show is because of the reputation it has and because it, uh, it targets uh, the mar market we're looking for, which uh, one of them is the children. You can catch the puppet show's last performance on 17th of February at Mall of the Emirates, Dubai. The Lambert Puppet Show is a great source of entertainment and education for little ones. But for adults who are looking for a little self-healing, come on down, revisit the child within. Because I'll even admit, you're never too old for a good old-fashioned puppy show. I'm Khaled Al Subehi. This is Dubai One News. No, 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 no. It's 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 Emirates News. Emirates. News? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I thought it was Dubai One News. No, no, news. no. It's Dubai One TV, and Emirates oh. News is the news broadcast. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. Will so, we do it again? We'll do it one more time. Right. Okay. Khaled Al Subehi on Emirates News. <laughs> and now here's a recap of tonight's main stories. His Highness the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi receives the Russian Foreign Minister. DP World plans to sell its assets in the United States.